Hello everyone, so we decided to uh, show you how we live here. So this has been our house for almost one year and this is our kitchen. Uh, this was used to be our living room but now it's a single room and uh, it, it turned into a single room like two weeks ago and we don't have any space to eat or do anything else so this is our like our common space um, this is our <coughs> washing machine we live here in 14 people and we just have one washing machine which is quite old and we are basically using it every day at least five or six times or even more per day um, we have one fridge here that as you can see we can't even open completely and yeah random stuff inside here uh, then we got um, or our shelves and cupboards and this is another fridge but as you can see we can't even open this cupboard this is our like where we put all our stuff then we used to have a garden but what happened is that basically our landlord uh, decided to close our garden after we closed our living room we were we used to eat outside but then um, Apparently, our neighborhood complained and they sent a complaint letter to us and our landlord uh, spoke with them and then he decided to <laughs> lock the door so we can't even go out <laughs> and yeah we can actually have oxygen at least but that's it so yeah this is the situation in the kitchen, we can go on and on for ages, but like we also have mice and they come from this little corner over here between this door and this cupboard and we also have like some problems with the hooven, like this part keep comes coming down and there's like all the dirty stuff and yeah so we can go in the other rooms and show you what else is happening around here so we have our amazing toilet which is under the stairs and our landlord once went crazy and he destroyed the door and then he decided to repair it putting this amazing sign and this is the toilet inside there's like just one human being can go in it and you can just like do whatever he needs to do or go in the shower if you want to see more so yeah uh, from that tube over there there used to come like some little insects they were like cockroaches or something similar and then we decided to buy this just to have, you know, something where to put our toothbrush and stuff. This is the sink and this is the only one working. This is definitely not working and it's just cold water. Then this is the stairs and as you can see it's broken. Then we got here our corridor and these are the stairs and then these are my flatmates <laughs> then this is my room which is the biggest double room in the house and even though it's really big I pay 95 pounds per week to live in this room and yeah 95 pounds per week guys I don't think there's anything else to say. Given the fact that this is the biggest room where we can be in, we are using it as a sort of a new living room where we can share our time together after work because it's kind of ridiculous to come back home and just don't even have the time to share with your friends or whatever. Then, given the fact that we are in 14 people, 
we also have a fridge upstairs and this is another room two people are living in here and one of them is the guy that is recording and the other guy is the guy that you can see in the oh, video yes. now and yeah. for this room they pay 85 pounds per week and the most interesting fact is that before our landlord closed the living room uh, we were paying uh, I was paying 85 pounds per week and they were paying 80 pounds per week but then he decided to add another person in the house which is living in the ex living room and he decided also to raise our rent weekly and yeah as you can see you can't do anything in this room we can just do like four steps and they decided to um, build this kind of I don't even know uh, extra thing where they can put actually their stuff because yeah, there is like no living space. The, the secret, the secret room <laughs> where we can put the dirty clothes and other stuff because this before was was in a living room all this stuff so we need to find a space in this room for put other stuff. Yeah, that's the situation. My lovely room. So, yeah, and we can actually go upstairs. Oh, another thing, these are the things that we are at um, the moment using to dry our stuff after the washing machine, all over the house, all over here. Upstairs, he decided to add another fridge in front of the toilet door so what you do is this is the fridge and this is the toilet door this is our toilet this is the second toilet that we have in 14 people I'm definitely sure that it is illegal but you know we'll double check that then we got another room another bath that of course we can't use as a bath because of course, as you can see, it's not really nice. This is all the dirt, all the things. There's not even a mirror. You can even you can't even look at your face in the morning, and then it's broken. We used to have like some leaks in the kitchen, so we were using like some kind of bowls to catch all the dirt that was coming from upstairs because it was going directly in the sink and yeah this was broken now he repaired it and then we have all the dirt on the top of the room that we can't clean or do anything about that even though he knows Friendly reminder, we are still paying 390 per month. Then we got which one? Your choice. Knock it. <laughs> so oh, the fridge here. Yeah. Another one. Strategic the one. They're like suitcase fridge. Then this is a trifle room. It's the biggest room in the house, but he told us that he's gonna turn it into three Hello. single rooms. Hello guys. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> he's gonna turn it into um, three single rooms at a certain point. We still don't know how and why. Oh no, I know why, because a single room is worth more than a triple room. And they are paying 80, no, 75. 85. 85? Yeah. 85 per month to live here. And I don't know, it's just, there's just one table and they have to share. Hello. <laughs> I wasn't living. <laughs> and 
they just live here. Then we need we need someone to show us the other room. Because we got no. that, so uh, I've broken wait. that. Wait. She doesn't know. Uh, in this room, there's a broken bed, but there's someone that's sleeping in there. And upstairs, there's another room where a guy lives. So yeah, we are in 14 now. 